Hi everyone, we will be going through an example on how to use SAP Process Automation, Workflow and Document Management Service together to streamline data entry tasks. So the idea here is this, we have a website with information that we want to record down, this section under Retail Prices, and instead of manually copying down these numbers into an Excel file, I'm going to use Process Automation to do it for me. Here you can see my Excel sheet with the prices that are different from the one on the website. And I have another sheet with calculations based on those fuel prices in the previous sheet of fuel prices. And Process Automation will be updating this Excel sheet based on the data that it finds on the petrol website. During this process, we also want to introduce a human element in order to inspect the changes made to the file, which is where SAP Workflow and the Document Management Service come in. So we will upload the file to the Document Management Service where users can gain access to it. You can see over here, I have three folders. This folder, Excel Workflow, will be where the file will be uploaded. You can also see that there are no files here yet. Um, so later on, you will see when the file is uploaded. We also have a SAP Workflow where the approval form will be coming in. So based on whether the user approves or rejects the changes made to the file, we will shift the file from the Excel Workflow folder to the approved or rejected folder. Right, so now I'm going to go back and close this website. And I'm also going to close the Excel file and you will see that process automation will open them up by itself and make the necessary changes. So let me run it now. So you can see here that it opens up the website by itself, captures the data, opens up the Excel file, updates the information, updates the calculations as well, and closes it by itself. So we can see here that the testing session has successfully ended. So let's go over now to the document management service and see whether the file has been uploaded. And yet, we can see that there is a new file here. And if we go over to workflow, we can see that my inbox has changed from zero to one. There is a new task for me. And it is the approval form where we need to decide whether the changes made to the file are to be approved or rejected. So before I make that decision, let me go to the file, right? And it's asking me whether I want to open this file. You click open. And there we have it. So here are the newly updated prices as well as the calculations based on the formula. And once we are done inspecting the file and the new changes made, we can go back to SAP Workflow and approve or reject. So in this instance, I will be approving. So I hit approve. And I go back to the document management service. So this file now should be transferred from this folder to the approved folder. So if I refresh this, yep, the file has disappeared and that is because it has moved over to the approved folder. So this is the exact same file. To conclude, we have used process automation in order to retrieve fuel prices from a website, use these fuel prices to update an Excel sheet and finally uploaded the Excel file to the document management service, as well as to create a workflow approval form so that we can approve or reject the changes made to the file.